forward. The Wyoming Pride Boxing Club is housed in a nondescript older building, barely large enough for a ring, in Wyoming's Porter Street neighborhood. But the club sent four boxers to the recent Michigan Golden Glove Finals, held at the Grand Rapids Deltaplex and covered by WKTV, with 123-pounder Junior Rios winning a state open class title and an invitation to the national tournament. On any given evening, 20 or more young boxers go to the gym to learn lessons in the sweet science and lessons in life. Well, our club started four years ago. It was started by my nephew, uh, Felix Martinez, and myself. Uh, he, had a, he had a leave, you know, he, he was a pastor and he got called to another, another city in the state. So I stood here with it and uh, I had Dominique Marciglis came and joined on with me and we can continue to to have the boxing club running. So it's been four years that we've been here working and it was, the intention was to help kids, you know, mm -hmm. get off the street, you know, and, and give them somewhere to, uh, to go after school and, and use the means of boxing to do that. You know, it helps them keep them off the street and they come in and they can vent themselves here and it helps them emotionally to vent themselves, it helps them physically and it keeps them busy, you know, and. And I tell you, boxing, boxing, you have to be, you have to be uh, very wise to fight. You know, it's just not fighting. It's, it takes, it takes skill to fight. You know, they call it the sweet science of boxing. Another two young men who appear to be thriving in the atmosphere created by Fernandez and his fellow boxing coaches are 17-year-old Mike Williams, who won the novice 114-pound state title after moving up from the 108-pound class and 17-year-old Justin Pierce, who won his first three fights to advance to the novice 152-pound title bout, where he suffered his first defeat of his young career.